Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today I'm doing another version of Jupiter's All the Games, this time with the Indie vs. PewDiePie's Game Jam. The theme was fun to play and fun to watch with an emphasis on laughter. Um, developers had uh, 72 hours to make a game that, from scratch, all the graphics had to be from scratch, all the like, sound had to be from scratch, that had that theme, and PewDiePie is playing the top 10, so if your game gets voted into the top 10, PewDiePie will be playing it. I'm playing all the games, or as many as I can. Um, I'll be playing each one for about a minute, so you can check them out. Links in the description if you want to play them longer. Um, there's going to be 10 games per video. If you want to check me out on social media, links in the description, um, which includes like Twitter, Twitch TV, Patreon, all that good stuff. And if you'd like to comment and like this video, that'd be great. Alright, next. Next, we're playing the game Capsule Arcade. Unfortunately, Lonely Spirit Games didn't have time to create an intro cutscene. This has nothing to do with the fact that they were lazy. I sincerely apologize. Well, it was a 72 hour game jam, so I understand. Let's do level 1. Maybe they'll update it now to screen. Oh, shit. <laughs> a little bit weirdly laggy. Might be just my computer though. It's like my actions, and you obviously can't tell. But like I move forward, and it's like it takes a minute, and then I move forward. So the response time for me is just a bit off. But not bad. I love, love, love the graphics. So it might just be have these awesome graphics. Am I supposed to stay on here until it's done? I'm not sure. Fuck. Get back out here. Nope. Well, I keep walking like I keep thinking that I'm gonna be good and I'm not. Damn it. Damn it. Anyway, next. Next, we're playing the game Highway Patrol Simulator 2015. So, case one is this lady. That lady. Okay. Hey, look, it's pay to win. Okay, what this guy? Get into the intersection. Oh, wait, it's a different set of arrow keys for the car. Oh, shit, I didn't know which way was the front of the car. Nope. Maybe I shouldn't be driving. Alright, there we go. Doing great. Doing great. Fuck. No one told me the road was closed. This way, this oh shit! All right, well, <laughs> damn it, it's okay. Make your way to the east. Why is this road so curvy? It can just be straight. Find the crashed car. Okay. Three. What's this? Seven. Six. What's this? Go back up. I'm actually not a very good police officer, if you can notice. I don't have my lights on, I'm speeding, and I suck at act. Ooh, I went underneath that gate thing. Why can't I cut across this lawn again? I feel like I am the crashed car. Next! Wait for this it. This is a story about a man named Sandy. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Yaggity yaggity ya, yeah, blah blah blah, okay we can skip this since we know it already. So where were we? And then one day something very peculiar happened. Something that will forever change Stanley. Something he will never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour until he realized that not a single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened. This complete isolation. Something was very wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. What he then discovered was that everyone had died. Wait. Okay, so maybe if we stick to the script, the game will function like it used to. Let's do this. 
When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay, fun. Very funny. A whole of course the door is not responding. Just pick the right and let's see where we'll get. Hmm. Seems like a really interesting version of Stanley and Parable. It is kind of scary. Oh shit, there's a thing behind me. Yep, I'm scared. Okay, freaking out. Probably gonna say next. There's a thing. Oh god, it's really ugly. Next. Next, we're playing the game Cats vs. Cats. There is no description on how to play this game. None. Whatsoever. Actually, we started because I only want to have one player. Let's see if I can request WHD in a second player. Ah! Nice one. You can make it and just not tell anyone. Like, for some reason, it's M. M to shoot. And I just don't get the logic behind M. The up arrow doesn't jump. Does that or X? I like the graphics. The graphics are so beautiful. I just wish I really knew how to play. Which I don't. Not really, anyway. Oh, now I'm stuck here. There must be a way to. Oops. Must be a way to jump. Ooh, that, that looks like some kind of. I just ran a bit. Pushing all the buttons. In. Oh, what's what button did I push? All right, so B to jump, M to shoot. I had some weird controls. All right, next. Next, we're playing the game the Minion Bot. Before the rise of the heroes, before the evil mastermind starts his evil experiments, there was a minion who did all the work. I'm guessing this was a minion. Graphics are super nice. Oh shit. Bird it died. It said left mouse button to shoot, but it wasn't letting me shoot. Like right now I'm clicking and nothing's happening. There we go. There we go. I like how it burst into a little pile of parts. Hey, you. Hey, meanie. That'll break you. That one just disappears. What the hell is this? I like killing things. You broken yet? No, oh, maybe it doesn't die. Oh shit. Next. Next, we're playing the game Vacuum Cleaner. It instantly started, so you can get to see the vacuum cleaner in three letters. This is Moon Base 4, calling regarding your talk to public. Oh, you guys probably can't hear me. There we go. I don't think I have to remind you that our relationships with the general public is pretty bad. In the shadows of the past disasters, we really need to make a good impression. What's your status? Never better. Great, we test the link in ten minutes. I'll stand by till. What is the floating behind you? Nothing. I feel like they're lying. Are those your underwear? You need to get that place in where ASAP. I'll call back in nine minutes. Call terminated. Wait, what? Astronauts don't clean? Astronauts are awesome. Computer full powered up thrusts. I have some cleaning to do. You get all this stuff floating around in the containers, only one item fits. Stuff the ship also counts. Stuff out of the ship also protects the astronauts from chart things. Awesome. This actually sounds like it'd be pretty cool. By the way, this is Vacuum Cleaner. Uh, if you didn't hear me, I'm sorry. So I just kind of gotta push them in by changing the. There we go. Done. Sorry, astronauts. It's kind of a weird physics-based game, which is the best kind of physics-based game. Yeah. I like the fact that teddy bears in there. 
It's gonna be hard to get out. Next. Next we're playing the game Ben Bear. I'm gonna do level one video tools maybe. Oh, this is like a, a whatchamacallit. A clicking game. Alright, so what is this? Level one marketing? I think glasses, man. What is this? Can I? Oh, I've been on Facebook. That's adorable. I love people when they make Facebook accounts for the players in the game. Like this. Like this. Alright, we've got some good marketing now. Probably should help our videos out a bit. Now, I guess it's gonna be a mobile game. So should... Let's pick up some more outfits. Get these pairs of glasses. The metal would be nice. This is one of the best clicker games I've played. There's a thousand we can get that. Right. Next. Next we're playing the Hyper Masculine Unicorns of Anarchy. It's the rainbow. I love these graphics. I'm already in love. Okay. You know what? Kapow. Hey, you wanna kill yourself? Jump right in. You know what I'm thinking? What happened if I jump in? Oh, you died. You died. Right. Who's like these graphics? Yo, you wanna buy some weed? Oh man, I hurt my toe. You're a cloud, you don't have toes. The heart back. You wanna hear a secret? Okay. What is the noise? This is like an endless runner. My unicorn's broken. My unicorn horn. Hello again. Not sure where to go. Next. Next, we're playing the game Flying Burnug. Next, I'm gonna fix this size. It's kind of cut off in the bottom. That's just because they put in an, um, an HTML game in a what is it called it's an html marked game but it's actually a unity game this is sort of like flappy bird except you stay still and things come and get you damn it my best is still five eighteen all luck. Damn it. Play one more. I like the graphics. Kind of like how cartoonish the planes are. Those planes just hit each other. Ha, ha, ha. Next. Next, we're playing Y Send Duck Witch. Bongo Bakio is sad. Bakio is sad because he is fat and he can't jump so much. But Bakio has a power. He can turn sandwich into poo. <clears throat> Help Baki eat the king of sandwich. Kwai San Duck Witch. Hi, I'm Bachicho. This is made by Stan. How do I? Okay. I was clicking on it, it wasn't working. To gain. Yummy, man. Press S or down to build Poopy Tower. Go away. Oh, no. Pointless volcano. Okay. 
Pretty simple game. I like the graphics. Mm. Yummy, mommy. Yummy, mommy. In one four. I can just keep going infinitely, even though it's a little Next 